What's going on YouTube, it's Kyle Scope. we're back with another video. In today's video, you're going to be seeing me use a reference image of LeBron James and manipulating this LaMelo Ball picture to my type of design that followed along with this LeBron James picture because I really like the 2019 Laker roster. And I wanted to bring this video to you guys to, one, show you guys just some nice lighting and just the speed art of the lighting, but just to talk about reference really quick and just explain why it's so important to use reference. So what is reference exactly reference is it can be a multitude of things but basically it's just using uh pieces of art that are already created or just like concepts that are already created and kind of just taking a little bit from them and then implementing them in your own style and your own unique way reference is never copying right so never think that reference is copying a lot a lot of people get it mixed up that when you're using reference you shouldn't be doing that because you're copying blah 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 and you should be doing your own original thing which definitely makes sense but people put it in the wrong perspective a lot of the time uh when you're doing when you're doing things with reference you want to always have homage to the original creators and uh, things like that and you never want to just like bite off of them directly but let's just face it we all use reference in designing and whether or not you want to be that guy that wants to say that you never have used reference and you swear to whatever that you will never use reference you do because something has been created before you so there's no way to avoid using reference you get me so that's what i want to say about reference and the importance of reference is that if you're studying images and studying other people's artworks over time what do you think that's going to translate to it's going to translate to your artwork being that much better because you've been studying you've been practicing looking at uh different references just a lot of the time while you're doing your designing or artwork whatever it may be um just having influence from from other people and just other photos that you find just normal photos edited photos whatever it may be reference is going to help you in the long run and i can say this um after designing for just about two years that reference has definitely helped me and creating my own type of style because after you use reference for a good amount of time you're going to be able to just only take the things that you really like and you're going to already have your own type of style that you like to create things in so reference is going to really help you out in that in that manner like for instance i'm using this picture of LeBron James to help me get through this edit but I already know the type of skins that I like to use I already know my lighting setup that I like to use and that comes from learning the basics first and then working off of reference it's just the simple fact of the manner so that's why it's really important to use reference and never be afraid to use reference and just have fun with it you just gotta have fun with it man uh, also I wanted to say in this video when you guys are doing your lighting as you see me doing a lot of lighting just make sure when you're using multiply and linear dodge those are the two things you want to really remember multiply and linear dodge now when you're using multiply multiply is a layer to make things darker so when you're using multiply you don't need to actually go to like the darkest shade of a hue that you're using you can kind of go to a lighter side and multiply is still going to make it dark on your subject and the same is with linear dodge linear dodge is the opposite linear dodge is making things lighter so you don't have to go to the most light uh, property of the hue or else it's just gonna look really bled out and really just miscombobulated and not very well very good and just confusing it'll just confuse you so remember that you don't need to do the most when you're using linear dodge and multiply on your lighting so with that being said make sure you guys use reference study images from your favorite designers or just from life in general and stay scoped i'm out